Welcome everyone. Hey, this is Ted Cook with Integra Coach here once again. A lot of you have been asking me about, hey, I'm supposed to have solar my coach. How do I know my solar panel is actually working? So starting with the model year 2023, we started adding solar panels standard on all coaches. Um, it's actually, we put, you may say you got one 290 watt solar panels. Actually, most of them are 200 watt solar panels. So you have a total of about 400 watt solar panels on top of your coach. And a lot of that can be read right here off the Vega Touch. So let me show you how you can get to that and actually see the reading. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and wake up this, uh, the Vega Touch here. And here you can bring it up. Now, normally it'd be on this home page right here, and that's what you would see. So basically, we're going to go right down here. And we are in a spire. Sorry, I should have mentioned that. We are in a spire. Anthem and Cornerstone people, you'll actually have a little button down here for solar panels. But on the Aspires, Riatas, and Riata XLs, you're going to push the little electrical button here. And once that brings up there, you're going to see a solar down here. So once we bring that in there, now that's actually telling us exactly what the solar panels are doing. It's showing that we're at 38 volts, 5.6 amps, other well, jumps to four. It also gives you a wattage reading. One of the things I do want to point out to you, a simple, every electrician knows this, volts times amps equals watts. So once it goes through from the solar panel over the controller, the controller is going to bring that back down to 12 volts, or in this case here, we're actually charging at 13 volts. And here we can actually see our 13 and now many amps we are, because the voltage went down, the amperage has to go up, and then you can see our wattage is off just a little bit because our controller is absorbing some of that power. So this is where you'd find a lot of them readings and exactly what my system is doing. Now, how much is this making a difference? Well, right now we're showing us at 14 amps. A lot of you, if you turn your inverter on and you look at it, you will actually see that it's showing how many amps are being pulled out. So you can actually see when we're up around that 13, 14 amps, we are actually putting in just about as much power as what the refrigerator would be using on a regular day like that. So once again, hopefully that helps you understand it. Now, a lot of people also ask me, can I add more solar panels? The answer is yes, you can, but the problem is the controller really can't handle much more of a load. So you have to go back in there and change the, the controller or put a separate controller on there and have your own separate device on that. Hopefully this has helped you understand stuff, but like I said, that secret formula is volts times amps equals watts. Got any other questions, give us a holler here at Integra Coach. Thanks.